Hi from Korea. Today I want to explain to you um, the notion of a billionaire. What is a billionaire? A billionaire with B, not with M. And a millionaire is somebody uh, with a net worth of one million dollars. And a billionaire uh, apparently is somebody with a net worth of one billion dollars. What does it mean a net worth? Uh, this is the uh, value of all the assets somebody somebody has. Uh, for an average uh, person, if you have a house, uh, let's say uh, with a value of five hundred thousand dollars and uh, I don't know fifty thousand uh, in your bank account, so your net worth is like uh, five hundred fifty thousand uh, dollars. Well, now assume you have a company which is worth uh, let's say three million dollars uh, you know company valuation is an another topic but let's say the uh, the value of the company is three million dollars and you have this house and the bank uh, private bank banking house so then in this uh, in this case your value is three and a half three and uh, three and a half million dollars or three uh, million five uh, five hundred thousand fifty uh, thousand dollars right now imagine uh, you have a really really huge company let's say um, uh, you have uh, you own a company with a net worth uh, with a value valuation of 200 million so you apparently your, your net worth is uh, 200 million now you uh, you own a huge conglomerate of uh, a, of companies uh, which is uh, uh, publicly uh, listed on some stock ex exchange and the value of that is five let's say now five, uh, one million shares each year is five thousand dollars so if you compute it you have uh, the company uh, value is uh, or market capitalization is five uh, billion dollars B, uh, billion with B uh, and let, let's say you own 40% of that uh, of the shares yeah in this case what's your net worth your net worth is 2 billion you are a billionaire right so this is how you can um, uh, you can say if somebody is a billionaire somebody isn't um, there is uh, sometimes it isn't uh, that easy if a company is uh, of course uh, is listed on a stock exchange it's easy to compute the, the value if you know, of course, how uh, and uh, how much uh, shares somebody owns. Um, uh, it is really relatively easy if he owns also uh, to evaluate uh, real estate. It is more difficult if somebody owns a, a, a private company, meaning it is not listed 100% of shares. Uh, is in his hand or in uh, in the hand of, uh, of few people then um, if there was la like a transaction like selling buying of, uh, of some uh, of some of some shares uh, the transactions are at some valuation so you can you can compute that there and uh, if not uh, maybe you may have you not always have the um, the revenue numbers the profit numbers and from then from them you can also and some projections you can also calculate more or less the value of a company uh, but it is a, a good guess for a profitable or very profitable company or relatively profitable company with a um, valuation or with a revenue above above a billion dollars that this is uh, also uh, a, 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 this company uh, has also uh, worth around uh, uh, or let's say in the in the dimension of, of, of billions of dollars and it uh, of course it depends on the prof profitability or exactly what the prof profitability is uh, what the future of the company is uh, if it is growing or not uh, on the industry there are several factors but in, in general the unicorns a unicorns, uh, so to say, so the billion dollar companies or more, uh, if they have like 10 billion in revenue, it's even even better. Of course, if they are profitable, if they are not profitable, it's a different story. Um, so this is the notion of a net worth for a person.